here's an episode of the cars of twisted metal that i absolutely should not screw up because i'm gonna be talking about the badass by the US government codenamed XJ39 tank from what I've heard from one of the unreleased clips of Twisted Metal 1. And Minion, despite him being a tank, he not only has an unbelievable amount of armor and a big huge badass special weapon, Minion is also very quick and has pretty sharp handling. And basically the end boss for Twisted Metal 1 and the mid boss for Twisted Metal 2. In Twisted Metal 1, Minion's special weapon was basically everybody's special weapon. And in Twisted Metal 2, he had a sort of a <coughs> special weapon called the Serpent Blast which b was basically Warthog's Patriot Missiles with a Freeze Missile in there. And that could cut through just about any vehicle in the lineup. <coughs> now in Twisted Metal Black, Minion went from a tank to a tanker truck, which could probably be su kind of a similarity between uh, Minion and Darkseid. However, <coughs> Minion Minion in Twisted Metal Black was the first one to have his very own his very own stage where only you and him would fight. And Minion lost his great speed and his great handling, but he still had an unbelievable amount of armor and a big time badass special weapon. His special weapon was basically a flamethrower, flame, flamer, flamethrower, that was on the top of the tanker truck and would spray at you and, of course, set you on fire. And that's pretty much <coughs> what sums up Minion there. In Twisted Metal 3, Minion got sort of a design remake where it was just a simple green cartoony looking frickin' tank with a big M on it. M standing for Minion. Who on earth thought of that frickin' idea? Just about ruined it. God. And not to mention is the driver's character design was pretty horrid. He looked like a frickin' Frickin' gremlin. I mean, God. 989. That was a bad move on 989 part. 9's part. You do not screw with Minion. In Twisted Metal 4, Minion's design got changed again to a regular tank with treads. And at least they didn't. They did a little bit better on that design. It had some kind of red graffiti on it too, well, and it also retained its serpent special, but <coughs> still, Minion is by far one of the most badass, if not the most badass char character in, or vehicle in the game of the series and and Minion's been absent for quite a while he hasn't appeared in Small Brawl or Head On hell he didn't even appear in Twisted Metal Lost where a bunch of the other characters pretty much everyone, every character returned from that game 
from black. So anyway, can, wrapping this up about minion, because minion's sort of a reward for those people that basically completed the whole game and has pretty much the most badass special weapon, most armor, and the best speed. I'd put it under sort of a easy, a beginner's car. However, it'd take an expert player to obtain him. Since, well, in Twisted Metal 2, he was unlockable through password, and in Twisted Metal Black, he was unlockable if you completed every other character's story. So, <coughs> that wraps it up on Minion. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, you, you, you. Did I just hear you diss on Minion? You dissed on Sweet Tooth too? Okay, that's it. I've had enough with you. Guards! Sweet dreams.